Hey gents, this is another one you guys have requested today. We're taking a look at Batch. They say right here, Conquer Mediocrity on the box. And this is the final puzzle piece in my dress shirt review that I've been waiting for. Uh, you guys have requested Batch. I've been looking at about a dozen other dress shirt companies that are online only to look at the quality, fit, style, price. To let you know about the dress shirts, I'm working on that script right now. And that will come out right after my subscription video that I'm about to post. So Batch is a unique company. They have uh, limited small batch runs of dress shirts. They have a white line, which is unique, where they have uh, little detailing on the collars. I think you'll see that in one of these shirts today. And then there's a casual line as well for like work or utility shirts. They also have one uh, sizing, so they have this kind of tapered cut, which they say is similar to a slim, but with a little more room in the chest. And so we're gonna take a look at Bash today. Just wanted to give you a quick open up as I throw this into my roundup video. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, please do. And if you are, thank you for checking out the best menswear on the internet. And let's just get right in here. We got a batch. It's like a little wax. Personally stamped wax seal. That is pretty neat. Oh, on both, both the shirts, both on the white and this. And as far as the, the shirts overall, uh, I've been liking just plain white shirts more and more. It's just plain, it's classic, looks good in any suit that you would wear. You can wear it with any tie. Uh, let's see, I believe this is the edge or the prime. And it has a unique stitching to the white itself. It's, it's reticent of a very high end um, you know, this kind of subtle textured shirts. It's it's something that most people don't notice, but when you do, it ma makes things look uh, very nice. So, we got the edge right here. We'll try this one on. And then the utility shirt. This is like a burgundy. Utility shirt, also in medium. So. Let's check out the white shirt. And then you might recognize this one. This is the Amazon buttoned down Supima cotton white shirt. Uh, I do like this one. It stands up well in a suit. And But this is my exact example. So batch shirts, uh, this is done by a small team. This is done by a small company versus you know the Amazon shirts. I'm more a fan of these guys than I would be of the Amazon in particular. But that's neither here nor there. We're here to get the best shirts, the best price, the best fit, and everything else. So we'll try this on and go from there. I like the way this fits, and I'm kind of surprised. Uh, they have small, medium, large, and I think extra large shirts. And typically you need to buy more of a custom shirt, but the medium on me fits pretty well in the body, and it's long enough in the sleeves, which is tough to come by for a lanky person like myself from 6'4", 170. And a correction on this, this is the edge shirt. So you'll see the cutaway collar here. I don't have many cutaway collars, that's why I chose this one from them. And a nice subtle lining in black around this. There's none on the sleeve. Some of the shirts they offer have uh, a lining around the sleeve or on the edge, but uh, I'm really I'm a big fan of this. I haven't seen this in other dress shirts, but in the elbow or in the inside of the elbow, there's actually stitching right here that helps to curve the shirt, which gives you a nice, more tailored look and feel. And uh, so that's a minor detail, but pretty nice on the batch shirts. One of the call outs of this is I've noticed if if you watch an interview with like Justin Timberlake when he goes onto uh, Fallon and he wears the blazer and just the white clean shirt, if you look very closely, if you watch on YouTube in HD, you'll see very fine, you'll see the stitching details within just the white shirt. So it's a little bit more standout than it would be if it was just a plain white shirt. So this is mercerized cotton. This is uh, feels pretty good to wear. It'll be, you know, I'll wear it and wash it and everything else and see how it stands up. But uh, I like it so far. They also don't offer not iron shirts. You know, back to my Twillery review, there's, you know, formaldehyde and other chemicals and non iron shirts typically. And so using this, you know, seeing how this travels and everything else, all part of my review. But I like it out of the box. And each of these are under $100, which is a good price for the dress shirts based on you know, all the other comparisons that I'm working on. Under $100 is pretty good depending on the shirt that you pick up. Another nice detail about all of their white shirts is they do feature Mother of Pearl buttons, which isn't the most important quality in a dress shirt, but it's a very nice feature. It signals quality, so you won't have any trouble with broken or damaged buttons as you wear the shirt. The utility shirt fits me really well. It has a similar slimmer cut as the white shirt does. I think it is just a little bit slimmer because these were both medium. Uh, sleeves fit fine. This is one of the more casual shirts. 
in my wardrobe. I do like that it has the uh, side buttons here so you can roll up the sleeves and button them. It's got the pockets. I like the color a lot. It feels nice and soft. So it's two good pickups and the white shirts will be included in my dress shirt roundup. This shirt, I'm just gonna go in my wardrobe and I'll wear it on weekends. There you have it, gents. That's Batch Men's shirts. I'll put a link below so you can check them out. Thank you for recommending them and including them in the dress roundup. It is one of the companies that are one of these only online companies. They give you great products at good prices and I'm happy to include them and show them on the channel. So if you have any other questions about Batch or additional companies, recommendations, everything else, working on all these uh, roundup videos for you, trying to get back in the groove for 2017. And until next time, gents, this is the Cavalier. Thank you.